War. War never changes. Well, except today, war changed and it's embarrassing as f Welcome back to SourceFed, I'm Steven Suptic. And I'm Candace Carazales. Here's a little backstory real quick. After two years of training with the US, Iraqi and Kurdish forces are ready to take back an ISIS-controlled city called Mosul. For what may be the first time, news groups are using Facebook Live to broadcast extended coverage of the event. Obviously, live streaming wars this seems pretty strange when you first hear about it, but here's why it makes sense. ISIS has a history of making well-produced propaganda videos with the message that they're undefeatable, so it's understandable why generals are okay with their operations being broadcasted. The real controversy comes from news sources encouraging viewers to react to the war with emojis. Channel 4 news in particular is under fire. Ha <laughs> ha no pun intended, right? War jokes are wacky. Ha ha ha. Channel 4 news is receiving a lot of criticism because as their broadcasts of the Facebook stream showed plumes of smoke and tanks rolling by, they encouraged their audience to react using Facebook emojis. Some viewers ended up using smiley faces and thumbs up. No, 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 you don't get it. The thumbs up were for like, uh, you got this, you go get that ISIS guy. ISIS guy? Yeah, and smiley faces for like, uh, I'm happy you're taking back your house or whatever it is. Taking back the, the city of Mosul. I think every major historical event should have had emojis. Um, like what? Like, imagine if I was live emojiing the story of Jesus. Or like, uh, when JFK was assassinated. Or even the Titanic. That made everything a lot worse. Okay, but now step outside of your own shoes and check it out from my perspective. No, I did. And I hate it entirely. It's the worst thing. Um, I did one more for the Vietnam. No, all right. Oh. Thanks uh, for watching, everybody. Tell us in the comments what emojis you'd use for historical events. I'm Steven Suptic. And I'm Candace Carazales. Go my generation. We got this. Happy birthday, millennials. Hey, Steven, you're also a millennial. Don't act like you're better than me. Before you go, we've hand painted your favorite hosts into elegant historical paintings. They're regal and they know it. These beautiful pieces of art have been hand painted, photographed, and reprinted on a variety of products. To check them out for yourself and for a chance to win one of the original oil paintings for free, visit the link in the description. <laughs> Goodbye! I feel like we all must have a little a little lengthy stories then, huh? Yeah. Yeah, we got Mine is kind of like, you know, Will knows mine. Yeah, I was there for some Will of it. Will was there for some of it. I eaten that jalapeno. Oh, it's in there? Yeah. Damn. Too bad. <laughs> mm. This first bite was just cheese and no pumpkin. So already off to a great start.